Hey everyone, welcome to Abstract Boss. My name is Ashley. Today I am doing part two of the flamingos. If you did not catch part one, I will put it up right here. Please go watch that one first, show some love, and then come back to this video and watch how I do the glittering on the mama and the baby flamingo. Let's get started. Starting out, I come up with a bunch of different shades of pink by just mixing some pink, some dark pink, some white, and then I also tried some a of like a deep blue all together to get my colors. So I'm just kind of working with whatever I can to come up with some great shades. Once I'm done with that, I can go ahead and begin. When I'm doing my glittering, I go from dark to light. The reason I do this is because if you notice there's a lot of white especially with the baby and you don't want to lay down white glitter and then try to do dark glitter on top because that is just going to stick to the white glitter and it's not going to come out at, and that's even if the glue dries. Glitter just sticks to everything. So you really want to work from dark to light. So I'm going to start with my beak work my way into the darker lines of the baby, and then I'm gonna do my darker bits of the mama, and then I'm just going to keep working my way down until I get to my lighter sections. After I'm done with that, I'll be able to keep layering more and more glitter depending on where I need more lines or where I just feel like maybe um, some of the glitter didn't stick all the way and just kind of work through that on my own. Um, but I will go ahead and just let you guys sit back and listen to some awesome relaxing music as you watch the process of the mama and baby flamingo.
So the downside to painting with glitter, I guess is the best way. See those bumps? Those are the glitters sticking up. So I am gonna have to sand. There's some on that one too. I'm gonna have to sand and redo this, which sucks. Uh, Cause I hate doing two coats of resin, but I'm starting to get used to it with all my glitter pieces. It's kind of like a required. And that's it. Let me know what you thought of the mama and baby flamingo. This is personally one of my favorite glitter animals that I have done so far outside of the turtle. Um, if you have not seen the turtle, that one is right here, but I really love this project. I have it listed on Etsy now, so if you are interested in this project, head on over to my Etsy page. The link is in the bio, and I'll see you next time.